Hi guys, I'm Ansif Ali and you're watching CG Hub video and today I have created this Fibonacci plant animation effect in UE5 Niagara and this effect is inspired by this effect this guy created this and this looks really realistic effect because he did in Houdini so the lightning and the model is pretty cool so I try to create the similar type of effect uh, but this doesn't look that realistic but you got the idea how to create that type of effect so all credit go to him I'll put his link in my description so you can check this out also so let's start this tutorial First of all subscribe my youtube channel and also click on bell icon so you will receive all new video notification. So uh, this is just a model I have placed okay then I have these rocks and these rock for this rock I have just a single rock this is my single rock with this material very simple material I just use this normal map and then I used one channel from this normal map to randomize the color slightly light and dark and this is going to normal and this is the base color so very simple you can make realistic rock if you want like he did his rock looks realistic uh, but I didn't work on that much then in particle I scattered these rocks so in my first emitter i use that rock mesh with that material and it spawned lots of particle 800 and then life is uh, actually life is infinite and these are spawning just at once and then random rotation for each particle a slender location radius is 110 and height is 20 and that's it then I duplicated this one and reduce the spawn rate and increase the size little bit so there is some bigger stones there okay so this is how I create the these stones and then this is my actual plant effect and let me just create this one from scratch so you will get the idea and I'll put this file on my Patreon so you can download and I have already done similar effect this hand effect this is also animating like this so you can also download this project file from my Patreon and I have lots of other effect uh, for this type of effect okay so let's start this from scratch I'll create a uh, oops I'll create a FX and fountain test and I have this fountain now and uh, I have this model of this leaf that I created in Maya okay and then the material so the UVs of this leaf just the planar from the top view okay and then the material for material I use this gradient so if if I'll show you in a planar I have this gradient then I'm adding some value on this gradient then cheap contrast and after this cheap contrast I am using this uh, three blend if I preview this three brand it gives you three color according to your white gray and black then in this RGB I am using this color green red and dark red and this is going to my base color then a noise that going to metallic and specular and the tiling of this noise I am randomizing in my particle then yellow for fresnel so if I preview my leaf this one here this is how it looks and if I preview this this is fresnel you can see this yellow fresnel on this so I am just multiplying yellow color with fresnel and this is going to emissive ok so this is my material 
now here I'll delete this sprite and use the mesh renderer and I will use the leaf and I'll delete all these modules even the spawn rate and instead of that I will use spawn burst like 10 particles and these are spawning on each other let's make the life maybe 2 for now and this is let's make it 2 it's okay and now I will use a torus location and make the handle radius 0 so these 10 particles scattered on torus radius but randomly so I'll distribute it with direct and multiply the u with not multiply you can multiply or if you want so I'll just directly connect with execution index and now I can change the size of this particle but these are all facing on y they should face outward the torus so I will take the initial mass rotation and this orientation vector just connect it with torus tangent and these are now all facing outward I can decrease the size of this torus now I need to rotate it so I'll take the update mesh rotation and on x direction and you need to use the mesh here and if i play these are rotating and if you want to make it slow you need to decrease this value and i will increase the life and one more thing uh, i'll just turn this off for now the initial rotation should be inside so i will just like this initial rotation should be like this so it will start from there and now if you spawn this uh, the loop very quickly it will multiply and it looks cool but this is not Fibonacci it's repeating on the same place and if you want to randomize that in torus there is this normalized angle you can rotate this whole shape randomly and also if I add some value here I'll just paste my execution index and now this add value is working like the same but you cannot randomize it here because it will randomize per particle I want my whole particle system will rotate slightly when it is spawning so in my emitter update I will create a float let's call it random and randomize it oops I hope my effect did not <laughs> crash okay whole effect gone I created that test but there is no effect that's my bad luck for now I'm doing that quickly again I'm not describing it I'm just doing it very quickly till then I'll reach at the same position okay so I'll quickly remove this take the mesh and I'll take the leaf delete the, all these I'll delete this spawn 10 particles take the torus location and direct add and execution index and okay everything is oops I did wrong thing I have to add here execution now these are scattered properly and now I will increase the size a little bit save this and take the initial mesh orientation connect it with torus tangent and initial rotation I will use this and then update orientation on X and I am this is rotating but I use mesh so it, per particle it will rotate 
live I will make maybe five save again and now I will spawn it quickly and now I need to uh, here uh, I need to randomize this value so I will create a float here let's call it rand and randomize it like 0.2 minus 0.2 and I will just connect this rand with this value so every time it will spawn it will randomize it and we are almost there and you can just think decrease the size and also these leaves should scale in and out so I will take this scale float curve and at 0 it's 0 at 0 0.5 it's 1 at 1 it's 0 again so this is how I did that I'll show you my exact settings in my effect so I am using this random parameter 0.1 minus 0.1 then spawn 10 particles my loop is 0.2 life is 5 size is 5 torus location then torus radius is 78 point something then I am using this execution index and then this random parameter this one then update rotation 1.12 and on x and then a parameter just to randomize the noise styling on my material that's it i hope you got it and let me where's my map so this is my fact this is pretty easy you can create and you can do better lighting because i'm not very good in lighting and i didn't actually give much time it's just i did it very quickly to just show you how to create this type of effect this looks really cool so that's it i hope you liked it download this files thank you for supporting me on patreon and on youtube bye bye take care